Um, so this is a, this is a uh, research prototype yep. developed by Nokia Research Center. All right, and um, what what we're doing here is a, it's a gesture UI technology that basically leverages the phone's camera mm -hmm. to track our gestures. And so what we've done here is we've connected um, the, the N8, yep. and it can actually be used with any any touchscreen phone. So an S60 V5 phone or any other. Any, any, yeah, and we're switching in the phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Right. And this is just a stand here, and we've connected the phone to the TV via an HDMI cable, mm -hmm. right? And the, it, it could actually be an AV cable as well. Okay, so it doesn't matter. But the fact, the fact is that now with a small application, with, it's only 34 kb, that we're able to leverage the camera as a sensor to track our track our gestures. Okay, so we've got two main gestures. One is click. The other is scrolling, vertical scroll. Okay, so let me show you this. It's really cool. Oh, there you go. Very cool. Very cool. Right. And then um, that's 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 cool and all, but even we can do this. So we can scroll. Okay. So this is not just this. This can be done for a lot of applications. Not all applications, um, but we can also you know sort of. Uh, play around with the with the menu, this and that, some basic basic features and stuff like that. So it's it's pretty cool. But this is, I mean, the key feature here, the key, the key focus here is understanding how to leverage the sensor in a device, yes. whether it's a camera or multiple cameras or anything, right? To um, to take the touchscreen experience away from the touchscreen, right? And this is important because we're having a lot of development in augmented reality, 3D UI, things like that, and. You know, for example, like, have you seen the movie Iron Man? Yes. Okay? Well, yeah, his, his lab, uh, yeah, these, yeah, these things yeah. are really cool, right? Yeah. And that, that, that's very, that, that's, that can happen, right? But when it does happen, how are we going to be able to interact with this, with, with this content, right? The only way to do it is if, we, if we're able to leverage these sensors, right? So we're already see, seeing multiple cameras on our, on our phones, right? Front facing, back facing, maybe seeing more, more, more cameras. Actually, can I, my first impression, I thought it's for the front facing camera, and I thought I was going to stand here and control the TV like yeah. this. Actually, yeah. I mean, that's yeah. that's all that's all possibility. So a lot of people have been saying, hey, this would be great for um, presentation purposes, training purposes, right? Yeah. Not all meeting rooms are decked out with like great presentation tools, right? Yeah, or, or, like or classrooms, right? right? Yeah, classrooms, right? Yeah. And so you yeah. you can just hook this up. And now you don't, you don't have to sit at the at the meeting room desk yeah. at the table and click on your laptop, right? right? Yeah. You're in the front interacting with everybody and saying, "Hey, how how, how you doing? How, how doing a little dance, whatever it may be, yeah. right?" And 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 then clicking on the screen. So it doesn't have to be just a a TV screen. It could be an overhead projector. Yeah. So yeah. Could I just get a little bit of footage of you doing this? Sure. Yeah.